Quebec, yeah. Greg Whitkey, president of Greg Whitkey, out here. Nice to be here. Uh, rumor has it you're having a little bit of a struggle with the with the with the flat stick. Yeah, you know, just a little bit. I, you know, I'm uh, you know that that three to five six footer the money putt um, just not been dropped up late. Um, kind of, I think maybe I'm leaving it open in some. Of course, I'm putting them some too, so it's a lot of inconsistency. <laughs> hey, I, I understand. All right, let's hit a few and let's see if I can Great. See, see what you're doing here. Appreciate it. All right, let's try this. Go for a little bit. Your back swing's a little bit long, I okay. think, and you're kind of recoiling it a little bit too fast. Go for a little bit shorter back swing. Try to hold your ball right, right. Right, right at the uh, right at the flag stick. So a little bit shorter back swing. Oh, well, that was a good putt. You hit a <laughs> you hit a ball mark here. All right, that was a good one though. That was better. That was better. Yeah. That seems to be my my biggest mess is pushing it out a little bit. You can show me a little something. Show me how the pros do it. And the reason I say this is because I get I get too long with my backstroke too. So this is this is what I'm trying to work on too. A little shorter. Push that one a little bit. And of course, trying to stay still is important. So shorter. Hold your follow through. Supposed to go in. Those are good tips. Uh, hey, while you're here, how about uh, help me with the long line? Uh, All right, let's go for a few longer ones here. Now, with these, Mark, I think my and with some with the short putt, but I've kind of known out here my golfing buddies for having what's called the Whitkey Nest. Um, always get close, never put it in. I guess from a lag putt, that's pretty good. That's but not bad from this range. Yeah. Statistically, you're only going to make about one out of ten of these at, at, okay. at best. All right. Uh, well, so, we'll take a look, see what you think. Right. Is that the Wiki Nest? Yeah, that's that it. Was, that's that it from all distances. That was, that was really good. <laughs> Your backstroke wasn't too long, and you, and you fell through right at the, right at the, right at the hole. That looked really good there. Hey. Uh -huh. <laughs> maybe I can give you a tip. Yeah, maybe. What were you doing right there? Tell me how you did that. No, I don't know. That was perfect. The, the, the whole key to long putts, really, basically, however long it is, is, is try to, you know, speed. It's all about speed, right? Um, you're not going to read your putt right every time from 30 or 40 feet, so just feel the distance. I've got another question for you, Mark. It's when, when you get on to a practice green, practice putting, how do you go about it? I mean, I've heard start with start with the short putts. I've heard some people say start with the long putts to get a feel for the green. What's your philosophy on that? You know, that's that's a good question, and that's entirely uh, up up to that individual person. Um, George Archer, one of the greatest putters uh, in the history of the game, the late great George Archer, he only hit like 50 foot putts on the putting green before a round. His theory was if he could hit the 50 footer solid, he ought to be able to hit the four footer solid. So he just hit long putts back and forth the putting green to get a good rhythm in his putting stroke and, and he just tried to hit the putt solid and then he wasn't going to worry about them, you know not hitting the four footer solid. Uh, other guys like to go straight for the three or four footers, make those first and then back up and then hit, hit the long ones right before they get ready to go out and play. So if they have a 40 footer on the first hole they feel like they've just hit one uh, instead of you know hitting a bunch of three footers before you play. So. Uh, there's a couple of different options. I, I actually like to do it the other way around. I like to start close and, and, and end up with, with some long ones uh, for that exact reason. If I have a long putt on the first hole, I'll feel like I just hit one on the putting green and I have a pretty good feel for the, for the putt. Great, great. Well, I appreciate those tips. I know you're busy and got other things to do, but I appreciate taking time for a hack like me. My pleasure, <laughs> Mr. President. <laughs>